A TikToker who felt gaslit by clothing company Fruit of the Loom set out to disprove a supposed Mandela effect. Mandela effects have become one of the internet's favorite oddities. The concept is defined as, quote, an absurd phenomenon in which a large segment of the population misremembers a significant event or shares a memory of an event that did not actually occur. A popular example of the Mandela effect is that many people remember a peanut butter brand being called Jiffy, when in reality, it was always supposed called Just Jif. The Mandela effect that drove TikToker Nicole to near madness involved clothing company Fruit of the Loom and whether or not their logo had a cornucopia in it. Nicole, along with many other TikTokers, were confident a cornucopia had been in the logo at some point, despite Fruit of the Loom denying it and posting this timeline of their logos on their website. After months of internet sleuthing, Nicole is confident she found proof that the logo did once contain a cornucopia and posted her findings to TikTok. Talk. I got to the bottom of the Fruit of the Loom cornucopia Mandela effect and I'm upset. Claire rarely pulled through for us and went through all of her old clothes until she found an official logo. Not only is this an official Fruit of the Loom shirt, except the cornucopia looks exactly how we've all described it and remembered it. This reignited my fixation and after digging through the internet, I found this old newspaper that specifically says Fruit of the Loom logo was initially a cornucopia. And Fruit of the Loom has been questioned about the cornucopia. They've straight up been lying to us saying that in never existed. Please note that this Fruit of the Loom image that was created from people's memories matches exactly what's on Claire's shirt. 